guys, welcome back to my channel. For the first time in a while, I'll be filming with natural light. So bear with me if the light will be inconsistent throughout this whole video. You guys know I love doing Shopee hauls. I also created videos specific for shoes, bags, accessories. Now I'm going to be talking about dresses only. Shopee 66 sale is coming up. There's going to be a lot of flash deals from the week leading up to 66 so make sure that you don't miss on any flash deals there are some items that i want to get for this particular sale so i've been checking their flash deals just in case those items will be in there so make sure that you guys check their up and also see if there will be anything that you might want to take advantage of in this period of sale but as for this video i think this will be the best shoppy haul that i will be doing there's not a piece in here that i don't like or i don't recommend i'm already throwing it out there but of course there are also items here that i like more than another so i'm gonna be going through all of it so if you guys are interested to see all of the items that i got then just keep on watching okay let's begin with the first item that i received these dresses came from the same seller i'm gonna be linking everything on the description you guys so it will be easier for you to find the seller don't worry because i'll be showing a try on clip of me wearing this so you will see what it looks like because it doesn't make sense while i'm holding it like this but here is the first item of clothing it's a red dress from afar you wouldn't be able to tell that the print is floral up close you will see that these are small flower details. It has buttons going all the way to the knees. Then there's a tiny bit of slit action. It has sleeves which is my favorite thing for dresses because that means that I can wear them to work and I wouldn't be dress coated. Then it also has a color detail here and then the middle, wala siyang button sa middle pero there's a tie that goes around your waist so it cinches your waist and makes it more flattering for your body so it gives you that hourglass figure the original plan was to wear them during summertime but we did not have the luxury to go out these are really nice dresses regardless that you can wear at work or on a casual weekend stroll for this video i also bought a dress for a plus size uh, i was planning to have my sister wear it for the sake of inclusion but unfortunately it was not delivered i even followed up with the seller but it's been two weeks and they haven't responded to my messages so yeah it's not gonna be on this video but as soon as it arrives i'm gonna be featuring it on a future video for sure got a little bit rambly on that red dress but I'm gonna be picking up the pace now for this one. Here is the yellow version of that dress. It's the similar style except the pattern is different. It has this bigger leaf detailing and it's so so nice in person. It has this uh, muted na mustard yellow which I really love. This one looks so good in person you guys. And I just couldn't say enough good things about the quality of the dresses usually i would see mga sinulad na naliligaw kapag bumibili ako ng dresses sa taytay because the seller is from taytay but for this one wala i have not seen any mga strings mga loose strings except of course for the buttons may maliliit dyan but for the most part, it looks really good and the stitching, the quality is so nice. The tela is also hefty. So I think it justified the price of 299 pesos. I love the design so much that I also got it in black and white. And this one has to be my favorite out of all the three because it's black and white so it's easier for me to style this slightly see-through because it's white so you have to make sure that you wear a nude bra and a nude underwear when wearing this but those are the three dresses from the first seller and i highly recommend them you guys ang gaganda ng mga dresses and marami pang colors and styles doon sa seller so make sure to check it out in the description box down below now let's move on to the next few dresses that i I got. I bought them from the same seller pero magkakaiba yung styles nito. So let me start with this yellow dress 
which has to be my favorite naman out of the four dresses that I got from this seller. It has a deep V design and then meron siyang cinching dito sa waist, buttons dito. I really like this detail because it shows off your curves. So I like that. It also has buttons going all the way down. This one doesn't have any slit action. So it's like a maxi dress talaga na, na yung buttons going all the way down. It has this floral, the floral design here. And yung color niya is also a muted na yellow. It's not mustardy pero muted siya. And I also love the design. Here's the sleeves. Meron siyang parang tali-tali effect dyan, which I really like. It adds to the girly vibe of this dress. And I just couldn't wait for the perfect time to wear that dress. So, yeah. Here is the next dress. It's this pink or old rose color. And then, it has polka dots design. It also has buttons going down until the hem. The catch though is that these buttons are actually fake. It doesn't open. So, pang design lang siya. Meron siyang invisible zipper dito sa likod. And that's basically how you will be able to fit in here. This one is pretty okay. I would say this is a good 7 out of 10 dress. Yung pagkakagawa naman, I couldn't say anything wrong with it. I just don't like the fake button detail. This dress, you can wear two ways. You can wear it as is or off the shoulders. But of course, I'm gonna wear it like this. Meron siyang elastic band dito sa my arms. So, medyo cinched yung arms mo. On me, hindi naman masyadong restrained yung arms ko. And out of all the dresses that I got, this one's a bit shorter. It's not a midi dress, but it's also not that full-on maxi dress. It hits me... I would say mga 4 inches below the knee. So it's still a good length if you want to be very conservative or if you want to wear this to church or if you want to be very modest, then this dress still passes as modest in my opinion. So I also love this one. Here we have a pink floral puff sleeve dress. It's very, very trendy. It has the puff sleeve detail and also that smocking detail here at the back. You can also wear this to waist, like off the shoulder or like a normal dress. And ang ganda-ganda rin ng detail nito sa baba. Ayan, very flowy, very elegant. I love this dress so much. But the thing is, I don't have enough boobage to fill this part here. So it doesn't look as flattering as I would have hoped. Or my shoulders are not broad enough for me to make this work as well. So I might just give this to my sister. This dress is what I think would fit a large. Medyo may give siya sa waist and meron din siyang give sa my um, tummy area. So this would definitely fit a large. If you have a bigger frame, then this would definitely look good on you. So that is it. This last dress I might be on the fence about. I kind of like it, but I also have some concerns that I want to share with you guys. So this is this white dress. In person, it looks so elegant, you guys. It has this parang... Yung fabric niya is not a straight up white fabric. It has this parang detailing sa kanya. Ayan. This one has a longer sleeve and then cinch yung may banda sa siko and meron din ganitong detail sa dulo. It has fake buttons and there's actually no way for you to open it. So walang zipper sa likod and walang totoong button sa harap. So you have to be in the perfect size for you to wear it. Otherwise, hindi ka magkakasya. Although it has an elastic band dito sa my tummy area. I would say from a small to a medium would be able to fit in this. This dress looks very heart evangelista, very classy, very elegant and sophisticated. But now that I think about it, why did I get a white dress? I mean, it's gonna be hard to wear this because of course white is gonna be see-through somehow. Like here you can see my hands. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna make this work. Of course, I need to wear something nude underneath. But I'm thinking, even with nude underwear, am I still gonna be able to make it work? So that's my concern. 
Aesthetically speaking, I don't have much complaint about this dress. It's perfect for the price, but it's just the practicality of it that I'm now thinking would be an issue. But that's really on me for impulsively buying a white dress. But if I happen to wear this dress, of course you guys will be seeing it on my Instagram. So make sure to follow me at Instagram, mycity underscore. That's everything that I have for today. Make sure that you guys check Shopee's 6 6 sale and flash deals. There's gonna be a lot of great things happening in there. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more Shopee and haul contents, fashion contents, and all of those jazz. I hope you guys are healthy and safe and I'll see you on the next one. May you all have clear skin and happy hearts. Bye! One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, I love you.